Hi Francois, nice meeting you. Great to be here. Can you tell me about the CQ 2008 trends? Well, yes, you know, we've been talking to a lot of customers and they're telling us that they're suffering from an explosion of data. New types of data, such as documents and images and videos that they need to manage. But also a proliferation of devices where that data lives whether it's the laptop or the mobile phones, mm. all of that data needs to be managed and secured by the IT organization. But now IT is also suffering from regulator regulatory compliance um, pressures to better manage and, and store and manage more and more data than ever before. And all of these trends are driving a data explosion within our organization. And it's driving data chaos and we want to be able to help our customers manage that chaos. Okay, so, so what will it be, SQL 2008? So SQL Server 2008 is the next great release of SQL Server, and we're really we're looking at innovations around four key pillars. The enterprise data platform, beyond relational, dynamic development, and finally, pervasive insight. So can you tell me a little bit about the enterprise platform and beyond relational, I mean, just briefly, well, the enterprise data platform is really delivering the core capabilities that customers need to run their most demanding applications, security, availability, and performance. But in 2008, we're introducing new features, such as policy-based management, that will make managing SQL Server a lot easier than before. You'll be able to manage SQL Server by intent and define policies that you can enforce on your SQL Server. That's super. We're also introducing a new feature called the Resource Governor that enables you to deliver predictive performance across your various applications. And that, I think, is going to be something very, very interesting uh, for organizations. Well, that sounds really, really, really cool. But what, what I mean, I was really thrilled when with 205, you know, with, with the BI tool. So if I ask you to give me one thing that you think is like the big hit or something you really like, well, you know, it's always hard to have just one. Yeah, I, oh, I know, <laughs> I'm, but I must be strict. <laughs> so if you're going to be strict, then the one I think is actually pretty compelling is the new report designer. And the new report designer uses the uh, ribbon interface that was introduced in Office 2007 Serious? to make it a lot easier to author reports. But we're also introducing new visualizations in SQL Server 2008 reporting services so you can drive more compelling, more visually interactive reports. And I think that's really uh, That's really cool. And even me as a non-database administrator can really go on the report stuff. I mean, I, You can go in, I slice go and in. dice, add that's new cool, charts. Cool. It's nice, very, very sweet. cool. So when can I have it? <laughs> well, you know, SQL Server 2008 is scheduled to be released in the second quarter of calendar year 2008. We're currently in CTP mode, and we've announced today the next CTP of SQL Server, which is the November CTP, that will include the majority of the new functionality that we've promised in SQL Server 2008. And then we expect one more CTP prior to launch. Mm -hmm. Launch will be the joint launch with Visual Studio 2008, Windows Server 2008 and SQL Server 2008, and then a following launch will eventually release the product in Q2, calendar year 2008. Okay, so I still have to wait for a little bit, but thank you so much for your time. Great, really thank you. It. Thank you. It was great fun. to be here. Thanks.